And so here I have a similar chart for facing uh, non all in 3 bet. This one's at 2.5x. And so again, you can see the hands that are made indifferent to the 2.5x. You can see the hands that are sort of close, that would maybe like, that, that maybe could be defends versus a wider range. Those are like 9 4 suited, 9 3 suited. But then there's also a whole bunch of hands that can fold given a tighter range like 10-9 off and queen-9 off and, uh, and jack-6 suited. And, and again, this chart can allow you to understand how to adjust versus smaller 3-bets or larger 3-bets as well uh, by examining the pot odds and just figuring out using that number as the new um, baseline to compare to. So if we needed 33% odds because of our, particular, our opponent's particular size, then, you know, king nine off would be close. If we needed 40%, then king 10 off would be close, etc. Again, this will work only to some level of precision because the range that you'll be facing will be different. But as we've seen, you know, GTO ranges are, are sort of very mixed and... Um, they don't change sort of that much with difference in sizes. Like they sort of are arranged themselves, but in some sense, that's just an obvious thing because we need to adjust to our opponents. And so in any case, we want to be adjusting to range strength. And so really all I'm saying is that, you know, these charts are given a fixed range strength and uh, you need to give yourself some wiggle room to allow for the specific ranges that you're facing.